Hey, Leo. You need to know this right now for January the 16th through January the 17th, 2024. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the star sign of Leo for January the 16th through January the 17th, 2024. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the star sign of Leo for January the 16th through January the 17th, 2024. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the star sign of Leo for January the 16th through January the 17th, 2024. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. So, Leo. Leo, these are your cards, honey. So, Leo. You have the Ace of Wands, Aries, Leora Sag. This is a brand new, passionate, creative endeavor. Now, this can be the spark of a new idea. This can be some type of exciting, passionate communication, exciting, passionate action. But this wand is symbolic of the male phallic and using the male phallic to be intimate. So brand new, passionate beginnings. So listen, Leo, you can tell me you have the spark of a new idea. Could be initiating something here. This can be passionate communication, romantic passion, or a heated discussion or argument, or starting a passionate new beginning. Clarify the Ace of Wands for Leo. Clarify the Ace of Wands for Leo. Clarify the Ace of Wands for Leo. It is clarified with the chariots. Could be dealing with a cancer, but you're determined to move forward confidently, victoriously, successfully ahead. And this can speak to travel. This can speak to relocating cities, states, countries. This can speak to moving from one residence to another or simply moving forward and leaving things behind. But you're determined to move forward confidently. So listen, Leo, it could be dealing with a cancer, but you're wanting to make some type of move here. Clarify the chariot. For Leo, clarify the chariot. For Leo, clarify the chariot. For Leo, it is clarified with the wheel of fortune. This is divine timing at play. This is the karmic wheel of destiny. This is a faded event. This is change in your luck and fortune. Where this wheel can spin and you can have good luck and fortune. Or this wheel can spin the other way and things can get a little rocky for you. So, Leo, you can tell me that everything between you guys has changed. You can tell me it's an actual change in your luck and fortune. Or this is about divine timing. Clarify the wheel of fortune for Leo. Clarify the wheel of fortune for Leo. Clarify the wheel of fortune for Leo. It is clarified with the three of cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is, we are reunited, and it feels so good. Let's go out, eat, drink, and be merry, and celebrate. <laughs> celebrate that we're reunited, and it feels so good. But this can also speak to there being a third-party situation going on. So, Leo, listen, you can tell me you have just cause to celebrate. You can tell me that you guys are reuniting, or there's a third party. And the reason why I'm laughing is, like, you can tell me that you're ready to move full speed ahead with reuniting and getting some cookies with this person okay you're ready now <laughs> now however leo you can tell me that everything between you guys has changed because someone had a third party here they started a passionate new beginning with someone and you're just wanting to move forward you could also tell me that you guys had some type of heated discussion or argument and you're wanting to maybe change things and reunite with this person we'll see leo you have the magician 
could be dealing with an Aquarius, but you're trying to manifest, trying to make something happen. And you have all the tools and resources available to you to manifest whatsoever you will. You have the fire element, the air element, the water element, the earth element, and the ethers. So with great focus and intent, you can manifest. So Leo, could be dealing with an Aquarius, but you're trying to make something happen here. Clarify the magician for Leo. Clarify the magician for Leo. Clarify the magician for Leo. It is clarified with justice. Could be dealing with a Libra. But you may be calling for karmic justice, saying, you know what? I'm a good person. I put good out there. I'm just expecting that good to return to me. Or you're saying that someone did me so wrong and so dirty. I'm calling for karmic justice. I want them to get exactly what they deserve. Or you're dealing with something in the justice system. So Leo could be dealing with a Libra. But you can tell me that, hey, something isn't fair. Something isn't balanced. Something isn't just. You can tell me that someone wants to come in and right a wrong and bring justice to a situation. Or you're dealing with something in the justice system. Clarify justice for Leo. Clarify justice for Leo. Clarify justice for Leo. It is clarified with the Knight of Wands. Aries, Leo or Sag. This is someone rushing into you or you're rushing into someone to start a passionate, creative new endeavor. Now, someone could be rushing in, going off, going ham passionately, rushing in with the spark of a new idea, rushing in with some type of exciting, passionate communication, exciting, passionate action. But this one is symbolic of the male phallic and using the male phallic to be intimate. This is flighty energy, in and out energy, player energy. So Leo, listen, you can tell me there's a rush to do something. Could be a rushing in, going off, going ham passionately with a heated discussion or argument. Or someone was out being a player getting cookies somewhere. Clarify the Knight of Wands for Leo. Clarify the Knight of Wands for Leo. Clarify the Knight of Wands for Leo. It is clarified with the Three of Wands. I can't wait another minute. I can't wait another minute for your love. Aries, Leo, or Sag, this is you waiting, waiting for your ships to come in, waiting for what you set your intentions towards to manifest. Now, this is also a card of you looking to see what else is out there, looking to expand. So, Leo, you can tell me that you're waiting. You can tell me that your ships are here. You can tell me that you're looking to see what else is out there, looking to expand or even travel you know, Leo, you can tell me that you're made to wait because, like I said, it could be a divine timing thing and you're ready to take off. But you can tell me that you're being made to wait here and you feel like it's not fair because you want to come in and get these cookies and reunite, Leo. Leo, you can tell me that you're trying to manifest to look to see what else is out there because something wasn't fair, balanced, or just. You guys could have had a heated discussion or argument. Or you could have discovered that they were out being a player with a third party. They started a passionate new beginning. So you're looking to see what else is out there. Leo, you have the Knight of Wands again, dude. Listen. <laughs> Leo, you can tell me it's a rush to do something. You can tell me it's a rushing in, going off, going hand passionately with a heated discussion or argument. Or someone was out being a player. Clarify the Knight of Wands. For Leo, clarify the Knight of Wands. For Leo, clarify the Knight of Wands. For Leo, it is clarified with the Eight of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve you. This is you detaching emotionally, feeling emotionally drained, and just walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve you. So, Leo, you can tell me that you're walking away, detaching emotionally. But when we're dealing with the Eight of Cups, this is someone who's leaving in search of their Nine of Cups, their wish fulfillment. And oftentimes, they find that the grass is not greener on the other side, so they end up returning. So, you could be walking away or returning. So, Leo, listen, you can tell me you guys had this rushing in, going off, going ham, passionately with a heated discussion or argument, and you walked away. You can tell me that you found that they were out being a player, and you walked away and detached emotionally. But Leo, you can tell me that you're ready to return and come get these cookies, Leo. I'm just saying, wanting to reunite and get these cookies. Leo, you have the Eight of Cups again. 
So like I said, you can tell me that you're walking away or returning. Clarify the Eight of Cups. For Leo, clarify the Eight of Cups. For Leo, clarify the Eight of Cups. For Leo, it is clarified with the Nine of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, this is you being anxious, worried, stressed, replaying things over and over in your mind, losing sleep at night, worried about something. So Leo, you're all up in your head, stressed, worried, anxious, can't eat, can't sleep, bothered by something here. So Leo, either you're bothered by what you're discovering concerning this person and you're just wanting to walk away, you're stressing and feeling like you need to walk away, you walked away and now you're stressed. Or Leo, you're anxious to return. Hmm. Leo, you have the Seven of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is having many options, but all of these options aren't viable. Now, this can speak to confusion, wishful thinking, fantasy, illusions, but having many options. So, Leo, listen, you can tell me that you're all up in your head fantasizing. You can tell me that there's some confusion. You can tell me that you need to make a choice. You can tell me that there was lies and illusions or the fact that someone had other options and explore some of those other options. Clarify the Seven of Cups for Leo. Clarify the Seven of Cups for Leo. Clarify the Seven of Cups for Leo. It is clarified with the lovers. Could be dealing with a Gemini, but the lover says, you know, I breathe you in, you breathe me in. We are so magnetically attracted to one another. We cannot get enough of one another. Babe, I need to make a choice. So Leo, could be dealing with a Gemini, but you can tell me that you guys have this strong twin flame magnetic pull. You can tell me there's another other lover, but the lovers could also be a partnership with work or business. Clarify the lovers for Leo. Clarify the lovers. For Leo, clarify the lovers. For Leo, it is clarified with the Eight of Wands. Aries, Leo or Sag, this can indicate that things are happening quickly. This can speak to travel, but this is the fast, rapid moving energy of communicating back and forth over the airwaves, the internet, with text messages, messenger, WhatsApp, emails, phone calls, even face-to-face -face communication. But this is also the fast, rapid moving energy of being intimate. So Leo, listen, you can tell me that something is happening quickly here. This could involve travel. You guys could have gotten into a heated discussion or argument, throwing fiery dots at one another, or someone was communicating passionately online with someone else or being intimate with someone else. Now, Leo, listen, you can tell me that there's some type of confusion going on causing an argument between you guys because there's another other lover. You can tell me that you just you guys have the strong twin flame magnetic pull and you're just having this confusion and argument. You can tell me that, you know... There was lies and illusions and the fact that they had other options with another other lover. They were communicating passionately online with this person and being intimate with this person. This is what you're finding out. This is the reason why you're leaving. So you well within your rights to leave. You're just trying to manifest leaving. Leaving, leaving, leaving. <laughs> leaving. But Leo, I feel like you're all up in your head fantasizing about getting these cookies. That's how I felt from the beginning, and that's how I feel in the end. I feel like you're fantasizing about this twin flame strong magnetic pull, and you want them cookies. You're anxious to return here. You're wanting to return to get these cookies. You just want to reunite and get these cookies. I'm going to take a look at the situation ship for you, Leo. Now, this is just additional messages here. <laughs> And it says, drama queen, thirsty, causing chaos. Drama queen, thirsty, causing chaos over here. Hmm. That's like sexual frustration. <laughs> what else for Leo? And it says, projected future days, weeks, months. Projected future days, weeks, months. You're anxious. I don't know if you can wait. I can't wait another minute. I can't wait another minute for your love. 
<laughs> if you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. Leo, you need to know this right now for January the 16th through January the 17th, 2024. You guys give me feedback. Subscribe, like, comment, and share. And follow me on Twitter at Her Immortal Madge, M-A-J. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.